You're using the contest app and you want to know how much income tax you actually have to put aside? Then you will get the answer in this video. Hi, my name is Mel here from Contest Tax Consulting. And if you use contests, you might be wondering what percentage of your income you actually have to put aside and where you can actually see that. That's exactly where we're going to take a closer look at in this video and specifically using an example. For this, I'll also take my own bank account. The start screen should look familiar to you. At the top, you can see your total account balance. At the bottom, you see your transactions and it also shows how much money you actually have in your bank account. If you have questions about the general structure of the contest app, then I have recorded a separate video, which you can find linked here. In this video, we want to take a closer look at how high the percentage should be that you should put aside. First of all, let's look at where you can set the whole thing up. If you click on the icon in the upper left corner of the app, you will open an area in your account where you can find various information about your account. We are interested in the settings, which you can find at the bottom. As soon as you click on it, you will see immediately that you can make certain entries for the income tax. We click on income tax and then we have two options. You have the possibility to set your personal tax rate here and the other possibility is a legal requirement that every bank account in Germany has to fulfill and that is that every bank account has to have the tax identification number of the account holder. What your personal tax identification number is, what the difference between your UST identification number and your normal tax number is on that, I have already recorded a separate video. You can find it linked here. Right now, we are interested in the setting of the tax rate to determine what percentage of your income you have to set aside. To do this, we click on tax rate, which opens an area where you can set what your tax rate is broken down by years. Why broken down by years? The reason for that is that you can have a different tax rate for each year. You file one income tax return per year, and so it can happen that in the income tax return for 2020, for example, you had an average tax rate of 25%, in 2021 of 29%, and in 2022 of 42%. This is exactly what the contest app takes into account by allowing you to enter separate personal tax rates for each year. You can change this rate by simply clicking on the number. The default setting here is 30% and here you have the possibility to set all tax rates between 0% and 45%. To find out what your personal tax rate is now, we have built a free tool that you can find linked below this video. Let's take a look at this tool together and calculate it with an example. This tax calculator will show you your average tax rate, which you can then enter into the contest app so that contests can set aside exactly this percentage of each income. To find out your tax rate, you have to answer several questions. You will find those questions predefined here on the left side and you can see your expected percentage below. That is, your expected average tax rate. We'll click on start here and the first question is a question about your turnover. How much revenue are you projecting this year? I assume that I will make 100,000 euros turnover this year. The next question is the question about business expenses. Why? Because I pay taxes only on the profit and not on the turnover. You can also move the slider from right to left and you can see how your tax rate changes on the left. I myself am at 1,000 euros per month for my running costs. The next question is about other income. This is pretty easily explained because you have to pay income tax on your total income. That means here you have to add your other income from, for example, employment, from renting and leasing, capital income, and all these things you can enter here. For me, this is zero euros because I have no other additional income. The next question is whether you're a member of the church and that's important in Germany because if you are, you have to pay church tax and that, of course, increases your tax rate. Personally, I'm not in the church and therefore click no. I'm not married and I have no children at all. What has a very, very big impact are your pension contributions. If you pay a lot into a pension fund, then your tax rate is reduced. Since this has such a high influence on your tax rate, we do ask that question. For me, it is 15,000 euros. That means I move the slider to 15,000 euros, click next, and as a result, get my personal, private, and average tax rate for income tax.
For me, it's 32%, which means I have to enter 32% tax rate in the contest app. As an important note here, it really is about the average tax rate. If you use Google to find out what your tax rate is, you will always find marginal tax rates or top tax rates. But in the contest app, you always have to enter your average tax rate. Now that we have calculated the personal tax rate, we still have to enter this tax rate into the contest app, of course. For this, I will pick up my bank account. We can see on the overview page that in the bracket mine, there's 3,441 euros. And now let's have a look at my tax reserves. The tax reserve right now is at 1,475 euros. However, I haven't yet entered my own personal newly calculated tax rate. For this, again, I'll click on the top left and go to the settings for income tax. Here, I can enter my personal tax rate of 32% for the calendar year 2021. And now, let's just see what has changed in the tax reserve. We see that the contest account now no longer has 1,475 euros set aside for me, but 1,573. This is exactly what contest does for you. Contest always puts aside your exact personal tax rate. With every incoming transaction, with every turnover, your tax reserve increases, and with every business expense, this tax reserve and the percentage decreases. And you can always change it in the settings. You can also change it later during the year if you surprisingly earn more or less than expected. The second important setting you have to make for the income tax is what we'll look at next. And for that, we go back to the settings for income tax. This is about your personal tax identification number. There, you select taxable countries. In most cases, this will be Germany. And then you have the possibility to enter your personal tax identification number. It is important that you do this within 90 days after opening the account. Otherwise, we will have to block your account. I hope this video could help you to get the right settings in the Contest app. We have also made other videos about Contest. Here you can find a video where we give a general overview of the app and explain these different pots. Also, you can find more information about how to set up the revenue settings in the app in this video. If you have any questions outside of that, feel free to drop us a message in the chat in the Contest app. Please feel free to subscribe to the channel for more tax-related content here.